Good morning guys, welcome to another Vlogmas vlog. Today I am going to be working out because the poll was so close, it was like 50-50 and on YouTube on here, you guys said we should all work out so I'm going to do my workout, shower, do all the things. I wanna go out today to get some more gingerbread men so I think that will be coming soon. My parents, weirdly enough, love the gingerbread men. They're actually all gone now because we ate them all. So I guess on to the clip of me working out. So I'm stuck in some traffic, so I thought I'd vlog. I don't know what this car is doing. Um, it's not on the road. Yeah, like, I don't know if you can tell. Like, that car is, like, not on the road. Um, I'm going to a Fresh Market to see if they have gingerbread houses to decorate. I really want to decorate, have, like, a little wine and decorating gingerbread house evening. I thought that would be really fun for the vlog. Got some inspiration from Sierra Furtado and yeah, so that's what I'm gonna try to do. If not, then I'll just like try to find a gingerbread house somewhere else, like maybe Publix or something. But I'm pretty sure like Fresh Market would have something. They have such good gingerbread men, so I'm also gonna get some gingerbread men because we have consumed all of the ones that we have. Again, don't know what this car is like freaking doing. Ugh, people just down the road. Oh my gosh, like Anyway, my road rage is kind of coming out. But anyway, the light's green. I will vlog when I get to Fresh Market. Made it to Fresh Market. Oh my gosh, it is so crazy. Like, look how many cars are here. It's so freaking crowded. Best gingerbread men ever. Gotta get a couple of these. Oh no, I'm good, thank you. Okay, so they didn't end up having any gingerbread houses or whatever, which I thought they would have. I mean, I knew it would probably be like expensive because it's like fresh market, but they didn't have anything. So I'm just going to Google like where to find gingerbread houses. Hopefully there's one around here because I do not want to go to Target. Target's going to be like a madhouse and I just really don't want to do that. Okay, so Big Lots, Walmart. Okay, so it says Walgreens sells them and there's a Walgreens like right near my house. So I'm going to try that. If not, then I'll probably end up going to Target, but I really don't want to have to go to Target because it's like super crowded and stuff. So let's see how Walgreens goes. Okay, so we're in Walgreens now and I just came across these like LOL things. I heard those are popular with like little kids. Oh, I do want this like wreath though for an Instagram picture. So I might end up buying that. I'll let you know if I find anything. Oh, maybe it's over here. Oh, I need to get some more Lindor truffles too. My brain is like everywhere when I'm seeing everything. Oh, yes gingerbread house oh my gosh gingerbread mini cottage good we have some options here i think i'm gonna get one of these that's perfect oh okay so here is what i got i got two packets of the gingerbread men the fam and i love these they're nice they're so good i got some cookie crisps because Valerie really likes them. That's the Fresh Market haul. We got this gingerbread village. I hope none of the gingerbread is cracked, but luckily there's like multiple houses. So if it is cracked, then there'll be like multiple chances. And then last but not least, we got the Lindor truffles. So good. And here's baby Yoda, cause Valerie likes to have this by her when she's working. Say hi, Valerie. Hello. People loved your cooking segment. They did? Yes. Wonderful. Well, this is my working segment. Oh, working segment. Working with Valerie. Right. <gasps> gingerbread type of night. I've never done this before so you're looking at like a rookie when it comes to this. Just thought it would be kind of fun to like try something new and stuff. Okay so let's unbox the gingerbread. Ooh, it smells good. Oh yay, none of the pieces are broken. Well that I can see so far. 
Here's the icing and the sprinkles. She's looking cute. I might use some of the box for inspiration. Little piping bag. We got all of these little candies. We got these. We got some little gumballs and some sprinkles. And we got the icing. I guess there's no instructions really. So I'm gonna try to do this as best as I can. Okay, so I got the first house's pieces, and this is what they look like. The front, the back, I don't know what this is. It looks like the bottom, maybe? Um, and then we have the sides. So I'm just gonna break these. The front, the back, the sides. I think these are, would this be the side? Or the roof? I don't know. This is hard. Okay, I guess I'm still trying to figure this out, but oh, gosh. I'm glad I'm not like an architect or an engineer with this thing. Yeah, I don't know what's going on here. Okay, so I figured out where the pieces all go, at least for just the house, which I'm just worried about the house right now. So this is the back, this is the front, this is one of the sides, <laughs> this is one of the sides, and then these two that look like this is the rooftop. I'm just supposed to snip this off and then put it in this bag. Let's hope this works out well. Okay, if we need more, I'll just end up getting more, but here we go. We have the icing kind of in there. You gotta just like squeeze it down, I guess. Okay, gonna clip this. Oh snap, it just popped off. Oh snap, well, I was smart in the beginning. Oh. Okay, I got it back, <laughs> I got it back on. All right, so let's do the front and then the sides. Let's do the front and the back. Oh, hello. This thing is like not, oh my God. <laughs> Surprisingly, they're staying up, but I don't know. We're gonna see how this goes. Cause I'm gonna try to get the back on. Like, look at this. I can't believe it's actually held together. That's insane. Okay, so I got all four houses built. There is this other one that looks like a little, I don't know, building. It looks like this right here, but I'm not gonna do that one just cause I don't really want to. Also, I wanted to do a taste test of this gingerbread. Maybe it's not the best thing to eat, but I wanted to try it. Kind of tastes a little cardboardy. Overall, I think it's okay. Kind of graham crackery, not very good, but. So I'm gonna start decorating my little gingerbread houses. And I don't really know what I'm gonna do, but these plates are kind of small, but we're just gonna work with it. I didn't wanna get like a plate for each of them. So we're just gonna decorate with what we have. I have this one over here and another one over here. But I'm just gonna start decorating the first two. I am surprised that my gingerbread houses actually are standing. They're um, very sturdy. Like I'm kind of surprised. I've never done this before. So that's why I'm just kind of like amazed at what we have going on here. But I'm gonna start decorating now. Okay, so here are the finished products. I am not that creative to be honest. I'm really good at copying, which 
I know is really bad, but I didn't copy. I just kind of went with it. But these are the first two houses. We got some, you know, party house going on. We got the Christmas themed house. At least I tried. Um, and then <laughs> this is my favorite probably because it's like the plainest and I'm really plain. Like I'm definitely a plain Jane. And this, I don't know, I guess it's called the social distancing house because I put these little dots like, you know, how they do in stores and stuff. So these are my little gingerbread houses. I'm gonna finish my glass of wine. This is my only glass because I haven't really drank that much. I was too concentrated on these things. So yeah, um, this is what the final products look like. Okay, so for dinner, I am having just my usual salad. I don't know, I was just feeling the salad tonight. And then some turkey. Again, I just put this on like on a napkin and then if I want more, then I just eat more. And then my little gingerbread man that I recently bought at the grocery store today. Um, I ate like a lot of the Buckeyes, so I left two for my parents. They're gonna be so mad. But anyway, yeah, this is my dessert. This is giant, I know. It's veggies and it's healthy, so I don't mind eating this much. I don't know if I will even eat this much at all. And I also have my wine here, this is my last glass. No, I did not drink the entire bottle. If you're wondering i can't do that i'm not talented enough and then i also have my water back there and if you guys are wondering what that is that's all like ebay stuff my mom wants to sell so that's what that's doing there if you guys were curious right now i'm just going to chow down on my food okay so i got done with dinner and my mom shiri just got home and she brought home these like krispy kreme gingerbread donuts because like one of these one of her co-workers brings in donuts and i'm gonna try it i guess Oh, it's really hot. I put it in the microwave for like just a couple of seconds. It's all right. It's all right, Sherry. What? It's all right. Is it? It's like not, I don't want to finish the thing, but it's not bad. I don't really taste the gingerbread. I taste mostly the icing. Anyway, I wanted to try it on camera for you guys, but it's all right. We are doing a gingerbread themed video, so it is the perfect time to try it. I don't know. It tastes kind of like just a glaze. But she did bring home some glaze, so I might get my fingers into some of that. But that is going to be pretty much it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in my next video. What's going on over there? I'm going to do your sum up because I thought it was the one I just brought in for me. Okay. Bye!